Early in this neighborhood's life, it was very active. Street parties in the fall, picnics in the summer. Carmelita and Julius live on one side of the main street through the neighborhood, and a lot of the rest of us lived on the other side. Carmelita measured and said it was 500 steps. 30 years ago, Melinda was walking down the street, pushing a stroller with her oldest daughter. Julius was on our front porch, holding our youngest son. And he's now 31 years old, so that means that it was at least 30 years ago. We're neighbors, but I think they live 10 houses away. How many steps did you say this away? 500 steps. 500 steps. steps. <laughs> I counted the 500 steps, but we really don't see each other very much until we come on road scholar programs. For many, many years, we saw each other all the time. And what happened is our children grew up and we don't see each other as much. We first started taking road scholar trips years ago. We knew Carmelita and Julius liked to travel, so we would keep telling them, you ought to come on one of these trips. We share a common interest in, in the history of all the different parts of the United States. In our laundry room, I have the United States that has uh, got little pinpoints wherever we've gone. She and John had been traveling with Road Scholar. One day she called me and said, John and I are going to Nashville. How about you and Julius join us? Okay, we'll try it. And we met them there. It was wonderful. Everything was planned for us. I think that one was one of the best because they were so excited about it. And they kept saying, you're right. Oh, this is such fun. Traveling with anybody on a trip like this it's great because it's all planned. You don't have to discuss what you're going to see today and where we're going to eat and all that. With Road Scholar, we interact more frequently back here too because we have things in common and planning and so on. I looked into Road Scholar and saw that they had a signature city in Chicago. I told Melinda, we're going to go see our son. And she said, well, John and I are going to join you. So that's what they did. And the next year, again, I said, Melinda, we're going to Minneapolis. And she said, John and I will join you. Carmelita's funny, a lot of fun, and someone with integrity and good values. On top of that, we never run out of stuff to talk about, and we never run out of stuff to laugh about. I have a towel in my kitchen, and it says that good friends are like stars. You don't always see them, but you know they're always there. And that's the way I feel about Melinda and John. Here we are, close neighbors, and life takes us away, separate paths, but this brings us together. We just have a lot of fun with Carmelita and Julius. We have Road Scholar in common now that we talk about and enjoy talking about the trips that we've gone on. We always enjoy their company where we are. We find things to talk about. The ones you trust, respect, and also have fun with, they're the kind of friends you travel on Road Scholar with.